Is it not like uh, poisoning or something? Because uh, it's not very clean. This is the biggest spoon I ever see in my life. And so, brother, what's happening? This is the uh, the small pot, which is 24,000 kilogram of food has been made it here tonight, and 27,400 people have eat from it tonight. How about the hygiene? And it's been washed and been sanitized it. And it cost around 65,000 of Indian rupees to make it one time. This is every day? It's every day. Jahangir? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. There's two pot guys. This is a huge one. They bear bearing food on it every single day. And there is one for donation. They can eat it here. They can check with them as well. Why they, they come? come? They come to for the blessing. The main reason is blessing. This enormous pot is the biggest pot in India. And maybe in the whole world. A huge amounts of food are cooked in it daily. Okay. This is the, the pouring of water on it. But why the, the water is orange? Because they have put the saffron on it. It's orange because they're putting this for saffron. Kind of spice in India. So they just watched the spoon. This is the biggest spoon I ever see in my life. And this is the rice now, they're gonna put it soon. Three people for this spoon. In the name of Allah. Dates and coconut. So this is the rice. Oh, oh, what's happening? Oil and rice here. What a mix. They got the best cooks in the world. This is from our side, uh, our family. Ah, from your family? Yeah. You can pay $1,500 and donate, and you get this private pot to distribute to these people. The beneficiaries of this food here are schools, hospitals. The community, they're living around here. Here, you can sponsor it. So this is my sister, I'm Tejas. Yeah, it's, it's believed to also uh, bring your wishes true. Basically, like your mannat. Mannat is uh, your wish. The goal is to basically, you know, get positivity for your own family. Fulfill any mannat, any wish you have. Why? This kind man. Tayyib is a big heart man. This guy who helped us and everything. And um, bro, is it not like a uh, poisoning or something because uh, it's not very clean we are having this from last 400 years so we, we are fine and fit from that so i, I hope you you want as well they've become immune now we will wait for for them to finish this stay until the end so this is a line guys for the food oh. it's getting greedy People are gathered here for the food. This is the queue. Butter. So they bought some butter and now they're adding some popcorn, I think, but... Fox nuts, fox nuts. Fox nuts. And what is this? And now they're gonna test it. Someone gonna go inside and bring the food up. Now it really looks like kunafa. It's so sweet. Are you sure, brother? So basically everyone like putting his hand because they wanna get blessing from this food. These are nuts. Nuts like cashews, they put a ladder in there to get the food. They're getting some blessings. These are the nuts. It's time to distribute the food.
He got in with his feet. Palestine, mashallah. Palestine. Come to Ajmer. Inshallah. Inshallah. Wow. Amazing. Very tasty. Sweet food. This is the end, guys. Welcome to Ajmer, yeah? Welcome to my city, Ajmer. Eid Mubarak. India! Ajmer. There are more than 200 million Muslims living in India. Today, we filmed one story in a small city. If you like the video and you'd like us to dive deeper and make a second part, subscribe to the channel and like the video. Ajmer Sharif, Mohabbat Sharbat. Watermelon. You're welcome, Marhaba. This is your, your daughter? She's the eldest one, she's the youngest one. <laughs> How old is she? She's six years old. Can you say hi? 